In the heart of a quaint, unassuming town, there lived a young woman named Emily. Her life was a tapestry woven with the threads of dreams, trials, and a love that had soured over time. As a young mother, she was the guardian of a sweet and innocent child named Sarah, the embodiment of her hopes and the keeper of her heart. In the beginning, Emily's life had been painted with the vibrant hues of love and anticipation, but as the years wore on, the colors faded, replaced by shadows of discontent. You see, Emily had fallen in love and married a man named John. Yet, in the pages of their union, she discovered a painful truth, John was not the good and kind man she had longed for. He bore a tempestuous temper that wreaked havoc on their once promising relationship. The couple's life together had devolved into a storm of constant arguments and emotional turmoil. The once bright horizon that had beckoned to them now seemed shrouded in a persistent and suffocating darkness. Chapter by chapter, we delve into the poignant narrative of Emily's life, a story that mirrors the realities faced by many, transcending mere fiction. With the warmth of everyday life English vocabulary, this tale unwraps the trials and tribulations that beset her path. It is a story of courage, determination, and the unbreakable bond between a mother and her child. Emily's journey begins with a realization that she can no longer endure the unhappiness that has taken root in her marriage. Her heart heavy with the weight of her responsibilities as a mother, she makes a life-altering decision to leave behind the turbulent existence she once knew in search of a brighter future. It is a difficult choice, but one she makes with her daughter Sarah's best interests at heart. Her quest for a fresh start takes her to the bustling city, a place of both opportunity and challenge. In her new environment, Emily is tasked with finding a job, securing a roof over their heads, and mending the pieces of her life that have been shattered. As we follow Emily's journey, we witness her resilience and determination in facing the struggles of everyday life. Her story is a testament to the strength of the human spirit, showing that even in the face of adversity, a new beginning can be forged through hard work, perseverance, and unwavering love for her child. However, as Emily endeavors to rebuild her life, she crosses paths with a man named David, a kind and compassionate soul whose warmth and empathy through the ice that has surrounded her heart. Their connection is undeniable, and the introduction of this new character brings with it a ray of hope. Through the pages of this realistic tale, we explore the themes of love, resilience, and the pursuit of happiness. Emily's journey resonates with anyone who has faced the trials of an unhappy marriage, the challenges of starting anew, and the uncertainty of opening one's heart to love once more. Her story serves as a reminder that, even amid life's complexities and hardships, the power of love and determination can guide us towards the brighter shores of happiness and fulfillment. In the ten chapters that follow, we will witness Emily's evolution from a woman burdened by a painful past to one who finds true love and happiness in an unexpected place. Chapter 1 the Unhappy Union In a picturesque, idyllic town, nestled between rolling hills and lush meadows, Emily's life began as a canvas of dreams. The quaint streets were lined with charming cottages, each telling a story of its own, and the air carried the scent of blooming flowers. It was here that Emily and her husband, John, started their journey together. At first, their love story had all the elements of a fairy tale. They were two young souls, brought together by the hand of destiny, 
with stars in their eyes and a vision of a future filled with love and happiness. The world was a vast playground where their love could conquer anything in its path. John's charisma and charm had swept Emily off her feet, and she believed that they were meant to be. Soon, Emily and John's love blossomed into marriage, and they embarked on a journey that they hoped would lead to a lifetime of happiness. The wedding was a beautiful affair, filled with the laughter of family and friends, and the exchange of vows that echoed with promises of forever. Emily believed that their love was strong enough to weather any storm. However, as the pages of their love story turned, it became apparent that the tell was not going to be one of eternal bliss. John, the man who had once seemed like her knight in shining armor, revealed a darker side. He had a temper that flared like a forest fire, consuming everything in its path. The joyous moments that Emily had envisioned were overshadowed by constant arguments and emotional turmoil. The disagreements escalated into fierce battles, turning their home into a battleground where love was the first casualty. As time passed, it seemed that the man Emily had married had transformed into someone she barely recognized. The once loving partner had become distant and cold, and the atmosphere at home was always charged with tension. Sarah, their innocent daughter, became the unwitting witness to this unhappy union. She saw her parents' love unravel, and the weight of their discord pressed heavily upon her young heart. Sarah's laughter, once frequent and carefree, dwindled as the shadows of her parents' discontent cast a pall over their home. Emily, too, bore the brunt of the unhappy union. The dreams she had cherished so dearly began to crumble. She could not ignore the emotional pain that now defined her marriage. Emily felt trapped in a relationship that was a far cry from the love story she had once envisioned. The first chapter of Emily's story serves as the backdrop against which the rest of her journey unfolds. It lays bare the harsh reality of a relationship gone sour, showcasing the vulnerability of human emotions and the complexities of love. Emily's life in this quiet town was marred by the turbulence of her marriage, and her quest for happiness would require her to make a difficult and life-altering decision. It was in this chapter that the seeds of change were sown, as Emily realized that she could no longer endure the unhappiness that had taken root in her marriage. Her daughter, Sarah, deserved a better life, and so did she. With a heavy heart, Emily decided to leave John and seek a new beginning in the bustling city, setting the stage for the transformation that lay ahead in her arduous journey towards happiness and fulfillment. Chapter 2 A Cry for Freedom The decision to leave John and their tumultuous marriage was not one that Emily made lightly. It was a choice born out of necessity, realization that the love she had once cherished had transformed into a burden too heavy to bear. The turbulent journey that had defined her life for far too long had reached a breaking point. In the quiet of their home, with Sarah tucked into her bed, Emily found herself at the crossroads of her life. It was a late, somber evening, the air heavy with the weight of the many unresolved conflicts that had plagued their marriage. Emily gazed at the sleeping form of her daughter, who had been the unwitting witness to the discord that had marred their home. She knew that Sarah deserved better, that she deserved a life free from the constant strife that had become the norm. The decision to leave her husband was a daunting one, fraught with fear and uncertainty. 
Emily's heart was heavy with the knowledge that she would be uprooting her daughter's life, taking her away from the only home she had ever known. It was a choice she made not out of spite, but out of a deep, abiding love for Sarah and a desire to shield her from the pain that had become a daily presence in their lives. As Emily packed their belongings, her hands trembled with a mixture of fear and determination. She knew that the road ahead would not be easy. Leaving behind the life she had known, the familiar streets of their small town, and the memories they had created together was a painful process. Yet, she understood that it was the only way to break free from the chains of an unhappy marriage. In the stillness of the night, Emily wrote a heartfelt letter to John, explaining her decision to leave. It was a letter filled with the pain of lost dreams and the hope for a brighter future. She left it on the kitchen table, a silent plea for understanding, and then, with Sarah in her arms, she walked away from the life that had once held so much promise. The journey to the city was filled with a mixture of anticipation and trepidation. Emily's heart was heavy with the weight of her responsibilities as a mother, but it was also filled with hope for a fresh start. The city represented a new beginning, a place where she could carve out a better life for herself and Sarah. Arriving in the city, Emily was struck by the bustling streets, the towering buildings, and the cacophony of urban life. It was a stark contrast to the quiet town they had left behind. Emily knew that they were entering a world of both opportunity and challenge, and she was determined to face it head on. Chapter 2 of Emily's story marks the pivotal moment when she made the courageous choice to leave behind the unhappy union that had defined her life. It is a chapter that illustrates the power of a mother's love and the lengths to which she would go to provide a better life for her child. Emily's cry for freedom was a testament to her strength and determination, and it set the stage for the challenges and triumphs that lay ahead in her journey toward a brighter and more fulfilling future. Chapter 3 Starting Over the bustling city greeted Emily and Sarah with open arms and a promise of new beginnings. Leaving behind the tumultuous life she had known, Emily was determined to forge a path to happiness, not just for herself but especially for her beloved daughter, Sarah. The first step in starting over was finding a place to call home. Emily searched diligently for an affordable apartment that would provide them with a safe and secure haven. After what felt like an eternity of apartment viewings and negotiations, Emily finally found a small, cozy unit that was within her budget. It was far from the spacious house they had left behind, but it was a place where they could begin building their new life. With a roof over their heads, Emily focused on securing a source of income. She knew that to provide for Sarah, she would need to find a job. The city offered a multitude of opportunities, but it was also a competitive landscape. Emily revised her resume, prepared for interviews, and began sending out applications. The search for employment was not without its trials. Emily faced rejection, silence, and moments of self-doubt. She juggled the responsibilities of job hunting with her role as a mother, ensuring that Sarah's needs were met. The process was both mentally and emotionally draining but Emily was relentless in her pursuit of financial independence. Despite the challenges, Emily's determination and perseverance paid off. She secured a job as an administrative assistant in a small office, 
a role that allowed her to provide for Sarah while also accommodating her responsibilities as a mother. The job was not glamorous, but it provided them with a steady income and a glimmer of stability. With a job and a place to call home, Emily's life in the city began to take shape. She started to establish routines, balancing her work with quality time for Sarah. Their apartment slowly transformed into a warm and inviting space, adorned with personal touches that made it feel like home. As they navigated their new life, Emily found herself leaning on the support of a few close friends she had made in the city. Their kindness and willingness to help in times of need were a lifeline, offering her a sense of community and belonging in an unfamiliar environment. They helped her acclimate to the city's rhythm and provided guidance on the challenges that arose. In Chapter 3 Emily's story transitions from the tumultuous past to the complexities of the present as she endeavors to start over in a new environment. Her determination, resilience, and the unwavering love for her daughter are evident as she tackles the practical aspects of building a life from scratch. Her journey is a testament to the real-life struggles faced by many who seek to reinvent themselves after a tumultuous past, demonstrating the importance of hope, perseverance, and the power of a fresh start. The chapter sets the stage for the continuing transformation in Emily's life, as she strives to build a more stable and fulfilling future for herself and Sarah in the bustling city. Chapter 4 Struggles and Triumphs As Emily and Sarah settled into their new life in the city, the transition was marked by a mixture of both challenges and triumphs. The city, with its vibrant streets and relentless pace, offered opportunities, but also demanded resilience. The routine of city life was vastly different from the quiet town they had left behind. Emily's alarm clock became the metronome that set the rhythm of their days. She would wake up early, get Sarah ready for school, and head off to work. The city's bustling streets were a stark contrast to the tranquility of their previous home, but Emily was determined to adapt. One of the most significant challenges Emily faced was managing her work and parenting responsibilities. Balancing her job as an administrative assistant with her duties as a mother was a constant juggling act. Sarah's schedule was carefully orchestrated ensuring she had a safe place to go after school and that her evenings were filled with nourishing meals, homework, and precious quality time. Financial stability was another challenge. While Emily's job provided a steady income, the cost of living in the city was considerably higher than in their former town. Bills piled up, and every dollar was budgeted with precision. Emily learned to economize without compromising the well-being of her daughter. It was a lesson in frugality and resourcefulness, but it also revealed her unwavering commitment to Sarah's welfare. The city's relentless pace could be overwhelming, and the absence of the familiar faces and support system they had left behind in their small town was felt acutely. Loneliness occasionally crept in, but Emily's determination remained unshaken. She knew that the challenges they faced were all part of the journey to a better life. Triumphs came in small, meaningful moments. Sarah excelled in school, her bright smile reflecting her resilience and adaptability. She made new friends, and their laughter became a testament to her ability to find happiness amid change. Emily's co-workers noticed her dedication and hard work, 
and she was gradually given more responsibilities at the office. With time, Emily was able to save a little money, enabling her to enroll Sarah in extracurricular activities that the young girl had always dreamed of. These activities were more than just leisure, they were opportunities for Sarah to explore her interests and talents, helping her to flourish in her new surroundings. Throughout the challenges, the bond between Emily and Sarah grew stronger. They became a team, facing life's hurdles with determination and love. Emily's enduring commitment to providing a better life for her daughter was the driving force behind their journey. Chapter 4 of Emily's story is a testament to the resilience of the human spirit in the face of adversity. It highlights the struggles that can accompany the pursuit of a new life in an unfamiliar and demanding environment. Emily's story reminds us that, while the road to happiness may be paved with obstacles, it is also marked by the small victories and cherished moments that make it all worthwhile. Her journey is a tribute to the enduring strength of a mother's love and the transformative power of determination. As the story unfolds, Emily and Sarah continue to navigate the complexities of their new life, discovering that their journey is filled with both challenges and triumphs, and each step they take brings them closer to the happiness they seek. Chapter 5 A Chance Encounter Life in the city moved at a relentless pace, with Emily and Sarah adapting to their new surroundings responsibilities, and routines. As they continued to navigate the challenges of their fresh start, an unexpected turning point awaited them in the form of a serendipitous meeting. One sunny afternoon, as Emily was taking Sarah to the neighborhood park, an encounter occurred that would alter the course of their lives. The park was a haven for city dwellers seeking solace amid the hustle and bustle of urban life. Children's laughter filled the air as they played on swings, climbed on the jungle gym, and ran around with boundless energy. Amid this backdrop of youthful exuberance, Emily and Sarah noticed a man named David. He was sitting on a bench, engrossed in a book his serene presence standing out in the midst of the park's joyful chaos. What struck Emily the most was his warm smile, a beacon of kindness that seemed to shine through the cacophony of life's demands. As Emily and Sarah approached the bench, Sarah's curiosity led her to introduce herself to David. Sarah was an outgoing and friendly child, and her innocent approach melted the initial barriers between them. David, displaying a natural affinity for children, reciprocated her warmth with a friendly conversation. He asked about her interests, school, and the changes they had recently undergone in their lives. Emily watched this interaction, initially cautious but gradually realizing that there was something different about David. His kindness and genuine concern for Sarah were evident, and Emily found herself drawn to his warmth and compassion. They exchanged a few pleasantries, and the conversation revealed that David was a longtime resident of the city, a software engineer with a heart full of dreams, just like Emily. This chance encounter was a turning point in their lives. As they parted ways that day, Emily couldn't help but think about the man she had met at the park. His presence had left a deep impression, stirring a feeling of hope and possibility. Emily wondered if this encounter might mark the beginning of something new in her life. In the days that followed, Emily and David's paths continued to cross at the park. Each encounter deepened their connection, as they shared stories about their lives, 
dreams, and challenges. David's friendship provided Emily with a lifeline, a source of support during the moments of loneliness and uncertainty that still occasionally plagued her. Over time, their friendship grew stronger. David offered to help Emily with various challenges, whether it was fixing her car, offering advice on city living, or simply lending a sympathetic ear when she needed someone to talk to. Sarah, too, adored David, and his presence became a source of joy in her life. Emily's bond with David was marked by the absence of tension and conflict that had defined her previous relationship with John. It was a friendship built on trust, respect, and genuine care for each other's well-being. As Emily continued to navigate the complexities of city life and single motherhood, David's support and presence became a source of stability and hope. Chapter 5 of Emily's story reveals the significance of serendipitous encounters in the tapestry of our lives. David's arrival in their life was unexpected, but his kindness and compassion offered a ray of hope amid the challenges they faced. The chapter underscores the importance of human connections and the transformative power of a simple smile and a friendly conversation. Emily and David's relationship would continue to evolve and play a pivotal role in the unfolding chapters of their journey, as they discovered that sometimes, amid life's uncertainties, unexpected friendships can lead to the most profound and meaningful connections. Chapter 6 The New Friendship As Emily and David's friendship continued to blossom, it brought a sense of warmth and companionship into their lives that they had sorely missed. What had started as a chance encounter in the park had developed into a deep and meaningful connection that transcended the boundaries of mere friendship. David's presence in Emily's life provided her with a sense of comfort and security. His kindness and willingness to assist her with various challenges, both big and small, made Emily's life in the bustling city more manageable. Whether it was helping her navigate public transportation, providing support when her car broke down, or lending a hand when she needed assistance with household repairs, David was always there, a steady and reliable presence. Their friendship was marked by a shared sense of humor and interests. They enjoyed exploring the city's diverse culinary offerings, tending local events, and taking leisurely walks through its parks. These shared experiences not only deepened their bond but also allowed Emily to step out of her comfort zone and embrace the vibrant culture of their new surroundings. For Sarah, David became a father figure, offering guidance, support, and friendship. He helped her with school projects, played games with her, and listened to her stories and dreams. Sarah's fondness for David was evident in her smiles and laughter, and the once quiet girl began to bloom into a more confident and outgoing child. Emily couldn't help but notice that her life had taken a turn she had never expected. She was no longer alone in her journey as a single mother. With David by her side, she felt less burdened by the weight of responsibility. His presence provided her with the support and companionship she had longed for, and the walls she had built around her heart began to crumble. In their shared moments of conversation, Emily and David opened up about their dreams, aspirations, and the challenges they had faced in their respective lives. Emily discovered that David had dreams of starting his own business, and his determination and passion for his goals inspired her. His unwavering belief in the power of hard work and the pursuit of one's dreams left an indelible mark on her. 
As the days turned into weeks and the weeks into months, Emily began to realize that her feelings for David had evolved beyond friendship. She cherished his presence in her life and found herself drawn to the kindness, compassion, and warmth that radiated from him. Yet, Emily was also acutely aware of the scars from her past and the fear of repeating her past mistakes. She struggled with her emotions, torn between the happiness she found with David and the lessons of caution that her previous relationship had taught her. Chapter 6 is a testament to the transformative power of genuine friendship and companionship. Emily's connection with David had evolved into a profound and meaningful bond that offered her solace, support, and a newfound sense of hope. Their friendship was a reminder that sometimes, amidst life's challenges and uncertainties, unexpected relationships can blossom and provide the strength to face the future with courage and determination. Emily's evolving emotions will continue to shape her journey as she navigates the complexities of her past and the possibilities of her future. The chapter sets the stage for the emotions and choices that will define the subsequent chapters of her story. Chapter 7 – The Past Lingers As Emily's friendship with David deepened, the echoes of her past lingered in the background of her life. She couldn't escape the emotional scars that her previous marriage had left behind. The fear of repeating her past mistakes haunted her, even as she found happiness and companionship in David's presence. The lessons from her tumultuous marriage with John had left a mark on Emily. The arguments, the emotional turmoil, and the shattered dreams were wounds that hadn't fully healed. These experiences had made her cautious, and she was determined not to rush into any relationship, no matter how kind and compassionate the other person might be. Emily found herself wrestling with the complexities of her emotions. While her heart yearned for the warmth and happiness that David's friendship provided, her mind was filled with doubts and reservations. She feared that her history of heartache might repeat itself, causing her and, more importantly, Sarah, further pain. She was also acutely aware of the responsibility of being a mother. Sarah's well-being was her utmost priority, and any decision she made had to consider the impact on her beloved daughter. Emily was cautious about introducing a new person into Sarah's life, fearing that it might disrupt the stability they had worked so hard to build. The past lingered in her thoughts, a constant reminder of the tumultuous life she had left behind. Emily couldn't shake the fear of repeating the mistakes of her previous marriage, nor could she ignore the scars that had not yet fully healed. She was caught between her longing for a new beginning and her apprehension about the potential for pain and disappointment. David, too, was aware of Emily's past and her hesitations. He respected her boundaries and the need for time to heal and build trust. His patience and understanding revealed the depth of his feelings for her. David was willing to stand by Emily, offering support and friendship, even as she navigated the complexities of her emotions and past experiences. In Chapter 7, Emily's internal struggles take center stage as she grapples with the uncertainty of her evolving relationship with David. The past lingers, serving as a powerful reminder of the wounds she had endured in her previous marriage. Her journey is a testament to the complexities of love and the courage it takes to open one's heart to the possibility of happiness 
even when the specter of the past casts a long shadow. This chapter sets the stage for the emotional challenges and choices that will define the subsequent chapters of her story, as Emily confronts her fears and seeks to find a path that balances the lessons of her past with the potential for a brighter future. Chapter 8 A Blossoming Love Emily's journey had been marked by resilience, determination, and the cautious opening of her heart to the possibility of happiness. As her friendship with David continued to deepen, their bond began to evolve, and the seeds of a blossoming love were sown. Their interactions had always been marked by a sense of ease and camaraderie, but with each passing day, their connection grew stronger. David's kindness, compassion, an unwavering support had become integral parts of Emily's life. As she spent more time with him, she realized that her feelings for him were no longer confined to friendship. For David, his feelings had grown steadily over time. He admired Emily's strength, her dedication to Sarah, and her resilience in the face of adversity. He found himself drawn to her warmth, her laughter, and the sense of completeness she brought into his life. David's heart had found a place where it felt at home. As their friendship transitioned into something deeper, the moments they spent together were filled with a sense of shared dreams and aspirations. Emily and David talked about their future, the goals they hoped to achieve, and the possibilities that lay ahead. They were partners in each other's journey, offering support and encouragement as they pursued their dreams. The city, which had once been a backdrop to their individual struggles, became a witness to the budding love between them. They explored its diverse cultural offerings, dined at its restaurants, and danced under its city lights. Each shared experience deepened their connection, and the city itself began to hold special memories of their journey together. As Emily allowed herself to embrace the love she had found, she couldn't help but think of Sarah. Her daughter was her priority, and she had to consider how this blossoming relationship might affect her. Sarah, who had developed a strong bond with David, seemed to relish the happiness that his presence brought into their lives. One day, in a moment of vulnerability, Emily had a heartfelt conversation with Sarah. She explained the feelings she had for David and how they were making her happy. She reassured her daughter that their bond would remain strong and that nothing could change the love they shared. Sarah, wise beyond her years, understood her mother's happiness and offered her support. David, too, understood the importance of Sarah in Emily's life. He had grown fond of the young girl and embraced the role of a caring and supportive figure in her life. The three of them spent time together, creating a sense of family that they had all longed for. Chapter 8 of Emily's story is a pivotal moment in her journey. It illustrates the power of love and the transformation that can occur when two hearts connect on a deep and profound level. Emily's blossoming love for David is a testament to the courage it takes to open one's heart to the possibility of happiness, even when the echoes of the past linger. Their evolving relationship reflects the strength of their bond and the dreams they share, while also highlighting the importance of understanding and support in the context of a blended family. As the story unfolds, Emily and David's love story will continue to play a central role in the chapters that follow, as they navigate the complexities of their emotions and build a future together. Chapter 9 Happily Ever After Emily's journey had taken her through trials, heartache, and the cautious embrace of new beginnings. 
As she navigated the complexities of her past, her evolving relationship with David, and the responsibilities of motherhood, she arrived at a chapter in her story where happiness seemed not just a distant dream but an attainable reality. Her love for David had continued to deepen, and his unwavering support and kindness had brought a sense of completeness into her life. The bond they shared had grown stronger, and they found themselves contemplating a shared future filled with dreams and aspirations. David's dream of starting his own business had become a shared goal. Together, they worked towards this common objective, combining their strengths and resources to create a business that would allow them to build a life together. Their journey was marked by hard work, determination, and the knowledge that they were supporting each other every step of the way. The blossoming love between Emily and David had not only enriched their lives but had also become an integral part of Sarah's upbringing. The young girl had embraced David as a father figure, and the happiness that their relationship brought to her was evident in her laughter and the sparkle in her eyes. The decision to marry was a natural progression in their journey. Emily and David decided to make their commitment official, celebrating their love in front of family and friends. It was a beautiful wedding, a symbol of the love they had found, and an affirmation of the family they had become. As they embarked on their married life, they faced new challenges together but their love and the strength of their relationship served as a rock-solid foundation. Their home was filled with love, laughter, and the promise of a bright future. Emily's story had come full circle, from a place of heartache and unhappiness to one of fulfillment and contentment. Her journey was a testament to the transformative power of love and determination and the courage it takes to open one's heart to the possibility of happiness. Chapter 9 was the realization of a happily ever after, a culmination of the challenges and triumphs that had defined Emily's life. It was a reminder that, even in the face of adversity and uncertainty, love can prevail and the pursuit of happiness can lead to a brighter and more fulfilling future. Emily's journey serves as an inspiration for anyone who has faced the trials and tribulations of life, and it highlights the importance of resilience, hope, and the power of love. As the story concludes, it leaves us with the message that, sometimes, even amidst life's complexities and hardships, true love and happiness can triumph and lead to a happily ever after that is well deserved. Chapter 10 A Realistic Fairy Tale Ending Emily's journey, as told through the chapters of her life, culminated in a realistic fairy tale ending. This final chapter is a reflection of the profound transformation and the enduring spirit that defined her story. It encapsulates the themes of resilience, determination, the power of love, and the pursuit of happiness, all wrapped in the fabric of a real-life fairy tale. In this chapter, the reader witnesses the beautiful blend of reality and the dreams that Emily had held onto since the beginning of her journey. The happiness she had yearned for, the love she had found in David, and the stability she had built for her family were now her daily reality. Yet, it wasn't a story of effortless magic or overnight success. Instead, it was a tale of the hard work, the trials, and the unwavering determination that had been the threads of her life's tapestry. Emily's path had been marked by moments of doubt and fear, a past that had left her with emotional scars, and the cautious approach to opening her heart again. However, 
Her story is a reminder that, despite the echoes of the past, love and happiness can prevail. Her evolving relationship with David was built on trust, respect, and an enduring friendship. It was a relationship rooted in reality, facing challenges and complexities, but also embodying the transformative power of love. The realization of their dream, the successful establishment of David's business, and the warmth of their family life represented the fulfillment of the goals they had set for themselves. The story served as an inspiration to those who have faced adversity, showing that dreams can be achieved through hard work, determination, and the support of loved ones. Emily's story also highlighted the importance of family and the role that support and understanding play in personal growth. The connection between Emily, David, and Sarah showcased the potential for blended families to thrive, with love and care as the guiding principles. The realistic fairy tale ending is a tribute to the human spirit and the unwavering belief that, even amidst life's complexities and hardships, happiness is attainable. It signifies that, happily ever after, is not a mere fantasy but a tangible reality, achievable through perseverance and the power of love. Emily's journey is a testament to the resilience of the human heart and the transformative potential of life's trials. Her story offers hope and inspiration to those who have faced adversity and reminds us that, despite the challenges we may encounter, the pursuit of happiness is always worth the journey.